What is heavy implantation bleeding and how is it different from a regular period? Friendly greeting and introduction. Hello everyone, and welcome to today's video. In this video, we will be discussing an important topic related to women's health, heavy implantation bleeding and how it differs from a regular period. We'll dive deep into what heavy implantation bleeding is, its potential causes, and how it distinguishes itself from a typical menstrual period. So, let's get started. What is heavy implantation bleeding? Highlight. Heavy implantation bleeding refers to the vaginal bleeding that can occur during the early stages of pregnancy when a fertilized egg implants itself into the lining of the uterus. It is often mistaken for a regular period due to its similar characteristics, such as the flow of blood and the duration of bleeding. However, there are some key differences that we will explore in this section. During implantation, the fertilized egg burrows itself into the uterine lining, which can cause some blood vessels to rupture, resulting in bleeding. This bleeding can range from light spotting to heavier flow, similar to a period. It usually occurs around the time when a woman would expect her menstrual period, adding to the confusion. How is heavy implantation bleeding different from a regular period? Highlight. Now, let's discuss the differences between heavy implantation bleeding and a regular period. Understanding these distinctions can help individuals recognize potential signs of early pregnancy. 1. Timing. Heavy implantation bleeding typically occurs around 6 to 12 days after conception, which is earlier than the expected start of a regular menstrual period. 2. Flow and duration. While heavy implantation bleeding can be mistaken for a period due to the amount of blood flow, it is generally shorter in duration compared to a regular period. Implantation bleeding typically lasts for a few hours to a few days, whereas a menstrual period usually lasts for several days. 3. Color and consistency. Implantation bleeding is often lighter in color, typically appearing as pink, light brown, or even light red. In contrast, a regular period usually involves a darker red flow. 4. Other symptoms. Heavy implantation bleeding may be accompanied by other early signs of pregnancy, such as breast tenderness, fatigue, and mild cramping. These symptoms are less common or absent during a regular period. Possible Causes of Heavy Implantation Bleeding Highlight. While heavy implantation bleeding is relatively uncommon, there are a few potential causes that can contribute to its occurrence. It's important to note that these causes may vary from person to person, and it's always best to consult a healthcare professional for a proper diagnosis. Some possible causes include 1. Hormonal changes. Implantation bleeding can be triggered by hormonal fluctuations that occur during the early stages of pregnancy. 2. Implantation location. The location of the implanted embryo within the uterus can influence the extent of bleeding. Implantation closer to blood vessels may result in heavier bleeding. 3. Multiple embryos. In cases where multiple embryos have implanted, the level of bleeding may be more pronounced. Friendly closing statement. And that concludes our comprehensive guide to understanding heavy implantation bleeding and how it differs from a regular period. Remember, if you experience any unusual bleeding or have concerns about your reproductive health, it's always a good idea to consult with a healthcare professional. Thank you for watching, and stay tuned for more informative videos. Take care, and until next time.